Hey traders, welcome back to another video. In this video, I want to talk about the use of switch statements in PyScript. And switch statements are used where we want to avoid the use of if statement multiple times. Let me show you through an example. So if we go ahead and apply the moving averages indicator to a chart, then inside the settings of this moving averages indicator, we can see that there is option or drop down to select the source and the method we want to use so do we want to use the simple moving average exponential wma vwma smma so we can use any of these but the way to do this or the way to change the calculation based on the selection on of the inputs is to use the if statement or the switch statement and switch, switch statements are very convenient way to change these options if i go to the code of this indicator then you can see that we are using the switch statement and we are providing multiple values or multiple inputs and then assigning them their related variables so here we are to simple moving average we are assigning ta.sma and then source and length which we take as input so we're going to build this simple indicator in this video to show you the utility of switch statements in PyScript. and if i go ahead and change any of these selections you will see the moving average will also change so for example if i change this from close to high then you can see that this line or this oscillator has also changed based on my selection so let me just go ahead and start a new indicator and here i'm gonna paste the code line by line to show you and explain to you how the code is working so first thing first we are assigning the declarative uh, variable of the version of PyScript, and then we are starting an indicator and inside the indicator we want to give it a name of switch statement so using switch using an expression so let me just go ahead and make the overlay to be true and then we can go ahead and start to get the variables that we want to calculate so for example here we are saying that string ma type because we want to get the moving average type and we are using the input to get the moving average so for by default we are assigning it hull moving average or hma and then here we are giving it uh and here we are giving it a statement to select moving average type and then these are the options we are presenting inside our input now we are going to use the switch statement to calculate the moving average based on the input so we can go ahead and use the mo float moving average and switch ma type so the so the format to use the switch statement is to give the variable declaration and then switch expression and the value one and what we want to assign the value one if this one value is selected and then value two what we want to assign it if this value is selected so that's how the switch statements in PyScript work so here you can see if exponential moving average is selected then we want to give it the close as a source the ta.ema and then 20 as the length however if sma is selected then we want to give it the ta.sma and close our source and 20 as the length so we can also take the input of the length but i have just given it 20 length throughout to keep things simple so here you can see hull moving average and if this one is selected then we want to switch this function and we want to calculate the hull moving average based on the selection and at the end what we want to do is we want to plot this moving average onto the chart so that we can see the result so now using the switch statement so if we had done this through using the if statement then it would have first made the code a little bit more complex and also it would not be very user friendly and it would be a little bit slow using more resources so here you can see based on the input our outputs or our calculations are changing using the switch statement so always whenever you want to use the switch statement first you have to assign a variable you can also here i have assigned the type of this variable but 
you can just write moving average as well and then is equal to switch ma type what do we want to switch we want to switch the moving average type based on the input so switch ma type and then here we want to give those variables or those calculations that we want to switch based on the input so now let me just go ahead and save this to our indicators library and add this indicator to the chalk so here you can see that we are seeing hull moving average by default if we go to setting you can see hma and if i change this to ema then you will see that this oscillator has changed because now we are calculating the exponential moving average and if i change it to something else like sma then you will again see that this line or this oscillator will change as you can see here so based on our input we are switching the calculation using the switch statement in pine script so that's how you can use the pine script switch statement you can also write a control click on this switch to see and read this in detail here you can see the switch operator transfer control to one of the several statements depending on the values of the conditions and the expressions so depending on your input the calculations or the control of the statements is changed and these are also very simple examples this is the example that we have just gone through and this example they are showing for entering the long and short positions in the market using the switch statement based on the exponential or simple moving average crossovers so i hope you like this video if you have any questions please comment down below i would love to answer them also don't forget to like share and subscribe see you in the next video